morning and welcome once again to review lesson four, the course of rest. We are on Tuesday's lesson entitled Reflectors of God's Light. Tuesday's lesson tells us that we are sometimes quick to discard things that are broken, quick to throw them away. If God adopted such a course towards each and every one of us, it would be a world void, a world uninhabited, empty, because all have sinned. As we reflect on David's life, many have asked, why did God place such a horrible story in the Bible? Why all the details of adultery, lies, murder, and cover-up? It should be a reminder to us all that the spirit is indeed willing, but the flesh is weak. In an unguarded moment, like David, our flesh can lead us into temptations which can change the entire course of our lives. In other words, our rest, our peace, our trust can be disturbed. Thank God that like David, we are able to exclaim later that my sacrifice, O God, is a broken spirit, a broken and contrite heart. God will not despise. And the lesson reminds us that every time God forgives our transgressions and recreates us again, something changes. God's precious forgiveness glues our brokenness together and the visible breaks can draw attention to his wonderful 